Another bear shot and killed in Medford city limits. The second time this year, police say they had to use deadly force on a bear. NBC 5's Christine Pinawanich has more on what appears to be an increase in bear related incidents. Christine? Natalie, back in September, police say they had to kill a bear that got too close to a school. And in September, they told me that that was the first time they had to shoot and kill a bear in city limits in the last 50 years. But now police say it seems like they may be seeing more bear related incidents and they're not quite sure why. Yeah, it was uh, up in the tree, probably about two thirds of the way up there. Around 730 Sunday morning, Medford police got a call about a bear up a tree. Neighbor David West snapped this photo of the bear. It's a bit difficult to see. Police say the bear had wandered into the 1500 block of Jasper Street. And we know that if you leave the bear alone, that they will eventually come down. And by 4.30 Monday morning, it did come down, but was now in some nearby brush. The unmoving bear, a concern for police. It's going to be Monday morning. There's a walking path that's right by there. And Jefferson Elementary. No more children! just a few blocks down the street. We're pushed up against the clock and we were running out of, out of time and we had to make a decision. Lieutenant Mike Boudreau says an officer fired two shots from a rifle, killing the bear. We wanted to make sure the public was protected. One neighbor we spoke with says the cops made the right call. You know, it's kind of a shame, but there's not much else you can do. In the past, the Oregon Department of Fish and Wildlife said they don't often tranquilize bears that wander into city limits because there's a high likelihood that the bear will wander back. In this case, ODFW told police that tranquilizing was not an option. Live in our Medford newsroom, Christine Pitawanich, NBC5 News.